So the, what I want to demonstrate today is, uh, is a, just a simple stopper knot. And what a stopper knot is, um, when you have a line fed through a turning block like this one here, and what a turning block is, is a turning block is just something that takes a line from a certain angle and redirects it toward a winch. So, like you see this turning block is going to redirect the line so that it leads perfectly to this winch. But a stopper knot is a knot that's tied in a line so that the line can't be pulled through the block accidentally or some other fitting. And the simplest stopper knot is an overhand knot, which pretty much everyone knows it's the simplest knot. You turn the knot, you turn the line and you pass the line through. But it's not a good knot because while it does stay tied, it is not easy to undo. When this knot gets very tight, it's very hard to undo. So we don't use the overhand knot. What we use instead is we do our uh, crossing turn and then instead of passing the line through the turn as in an overhand knot, we pass the line around the back of the standing part and then through, and that's called a figure eight knot. And a figure eight knot, unlike an overhand knot, is very easy to untie if it gets tight. You can see the crossing turn tightens on the working end, but just like in the bowlin, this turn back here away from the crossing turn is easy to bend forward and loosen the knot. The other, and so that's a good knot to have as a stopper knot in some lines. 